Hello, Pisces. Thank you for tuning into my channel. I definitely appreciate all the love and support, and I send it right back to you guys. Be sure to hit that like button, leave a comment. This reading resonates. Only take what resonates, leave the rest behind. Do not force these messages to fit. With that being said, let's go ahead and see what messages are coming through for you guys at this time. this is really good your overall energy is integrity so i'm getting like you guys not willing to stoop to any level like not willing to stoop low here like your vibration your frequency has elevated and you guys aren't stooping to any low levels here. It's like you're really, con it's like integrity here, full of integrity. Um, your your energy right now is awakening and decision. So I'm getting, you guys are going through some form of spiritual growth, some form of spiritual awakening here. That's going to lead to a decision. So I'm getting some of you guys like when it's regarding love. Um, there's someone from your past here that you guys have a lot of love for. And this person, it's like, as you guys are going through this spiritual awakening here, you're beginning to see this person in a different light and you don't like the ways you were treated by this person. You're really um, assessing and um, I'm getting evaluating this, this relationship between the two of you. A part of you knows that someone is coming back towards you. You know that this person will be, and then the thing is here, I'm getting like this person is also going through some form of spiritual awakening themselves. So you guys will be faced with a decision in love, whether it's friendship, family, or romantic relationship here. Or if you, some of you guys, if you want to focus on love at all. Because here in your near future, you guys have finances in abundance. So there is a significant financial increase in your money coming here in the near future. Some of you guys could have been working really hard towards something and it's about to pay off for you big time because your finances are looking amazing. What you need to look out for is trust and healing. So you guys need to have more trust in the particular situation that things will turn around. Things will improve in a particular situation here. Now, in your outcome, you have vulnerability and patience. So, what am I getting, like, with your outcome? Let me see. How can I say this? It's really just like a part of like trusting. You've had to be patient with a particular situation, but it leaves you feeling very vulnerable, which it like plays on your anxiety. Um, feeling like you're vulnerable here. It like, it's, it's an anxious sort of energy here, but it's like you're needing to still be patient hearing your outcome. So it's like you are expecting something at a certain time, but you, you still need to be patient. It's taking a little bit longer than you are expecting. But there is a lot of, you're needing to have trust that something is going to turn around. Some of you got, because like your finances are looking amazing here. But it's just not happening as soon as you would like it to. But you need to trust that it is definitely happening for you.
your reading is really good, Pisces. Ooh, okay. Someone is about to take a leap of faith, a risk to come towards you. Someone will be traveling towards you. Some of you guys, it could possibly be a cancer here. This person will be making an offer to you out the blue. Now, why am I saying here, you guys, it's like you're discontent with a particular situation. You guys are focusing on um, some relationships here that did not work out. You guys could have made several attempts here with someone and it's like you are no longer accepting this person's offer. You're really disappointed, discontent with a particular situation from someone. This person took a risk on this relationship here. Your overall energy is the Empress in reverse. Because I'm getting like this annoyance in your energy due to a lack of growth in a particular situation. You're no longer looking at someone as like the full package here. You're starting to, um, your interest in someone is, you're starting to lose interest in someone here. Because I'm getting that this person took too long. The issue with this person here is they thought that you would continue to wait for them. So when this person finally does come towards you with this offer, you're going to reject this person's offer. And it's because of how long they took to come towards you. You're just really dis discontent and dissatisfied with their behavior. What you need to look out for is this person, they're not going to uh, give up on this connection that easily. They're going to be holding on to this connection. And the thing is, is I don't see this person. They didn't put any effort in this connection, but they really thought that they were going to be able to, like they thought that they had you. Some Like they didn't think that they needed to put any effort into this situation. They just thought you weren't going anywhere. But it's like during this time of separation, some of you guys could have met someone, this person, you look at this person like your angel. Like this person is just very calm. Um, they're very caring towards you, very affectionate. Um, you feel like this person brings a lot of balance and harmony into your life and you feel like they're a soulmate. Um, I'm getting like, like you guys because there's... You guys are going to be happy. It's like you have some a decision here to make. And you're going to be happy. And it's regarding a partnership. It's coming in towards you. Possibly within the next three months here. Someone is definitely traveling towards you. They're taking a, a leap of faith to come towards you. Um, they're leaving the baggage of the past behind. So this person has gone through some things here. But they don't want to bring that into this relationship with you. So they're leaving that in the past. You guys are aware that someone is coming towards you. I'm getting that this is some of you guys that could possibly be a Sagittarius. You have Cancer and Sagittarius here. And you also have Taurus. You're going to be really happy with the decision that you make. Because there's a lot of growth and expansion in a relationship here. And it's not with this person because you guys are releasing someone. And then there's someone new traveling towards you. This person is going to be very healing for you as well. And the reason why you guys are giving up on this particular situation is because there's been a lack of growth and this has been going on for some time. It just hasn't been going anywhere. And you're tired of trying to give this person the benefit of the doubt.
Okay, so you guys definitely have a long-term commitment here on the horizon for you because marriage is popping up. So whether you end up marrying this person or this is just someone that you'll end up, it's basically leading towards marriage or just a long-term commitment. Now, there's also another energy here. Um, the thing is, is this is a particular situation. It's like, because you have stopped trying to fix this situation because there is someone better but this person is going to be coming towards you saying that we need to talk. But what you need to know is that they're a liar. Um, this person has low self-esteem. And there's someone better coming towards you. Someone with more confidence and someone who's going to treat you the way that you deserve to be treated. This person is going to be like, you're my favorite part of every day. Some of y'all could possibly know this person already because either you or one of y'all are waiting to hear from this person or you will be. Like y'all give me a number out to someone and then you're waiting for them to, you know, hit you up here. But this person is a uh, little, they will be dependable. This person is going to come and sweep you off your feet. You know, I'm getting, there was someone who didn't think you were going to do much with your life, that like you weren't going to turn out to be who you are today or who you are becoming, because I'm getting someone will be seeing you in a different light, like they definitely underestimated you, they underestimated your power. This person is going, it's like they're waiting on you to call, to text them, it's, it's like this person is going to be begging you to talk to them. They're worried. It's like this person is realizing how powerful you are. Because I'm saying that you guys have like manifested something amazing in your life here. And this person realized what it's like not to have you in their life anymore. And it's really upsetting to this person. And they're going to be desperate here in the near future. You guys have unconditional love. Don't settle. So you know with someone in particular, you would. Um, don't worry about haters as well. Some of you guys will have people hating on your connection with someone because you two will work things out. Like despite what any... Be yeah, there is some people here, someone here trying to be all up in your business with a particular relationship here. And don't worry about these people. They definitely talk behind your back. But they talk behind everyone's back here, including you. I'm getting, y'all, these, whoever is talking behind your back, they're telling this person. Because some of y'all have someone, it's like y'all could have met someone at work or you met someone through friends here. Whoever, it's like you guys have some type of like common ground here. And there are some people hating on this connection between you and this person. Because I'm getting people telling this person that you get around. Or someone telling you that your person gets around here. And they're telling this person not to settle. Like they will be settling if they were to talk to you or to date you. But it's not going to matter because this person has like unconditional love. They feel like you're their better half. They feel like they're meant to be like you two are meant to be together. They feel like you. it's just faded. I'm getting like this person, like they definitely, you guys have a secret admirer here, some of you guys. 
And the reason why they're holding back is because they're hearing all this stuff about you and they're not quite sure what to think, but they're not going to feed into the lies. It's not gonna keep them from coming towards you. It may have them thinking that this moment, but ultimately they're gonna end up coming towards you. That is it, um, Pisces. These are the messages that I have for you at this time. Uh, please be sure to hit that like button, subscribe to the channel. I definitely appreciate all the love and support and I'll send it right back to you guys. Take care.